not going to get too much into this, but you know that you can select these guys and weld, but then, hey, you, there's a point between here that you selected and you have to deselect that and weld again. Take this one and that one, weld. Take this one and that one and deselect. It's kind of like a drag at times. So um, now in this case, of course, you could use other methods. Uh, you could, for example, use stuff like weld strip and, and that stuff uh, to make this one go here. But I'm just showing this as an example. Um, but anyway, so by, by welding these points, uh, it's easy to make a mistake. So what you do actually uh, is that you uh, loop this one, take that one. Uh, actually, no, we'll take this one and that one and loop and convert that to point selection. And uh, what we'll do here is we'll use the snap drag tool. That way, there's no way for us to actually snap to the wrong point or weld to the wrong point. So now I can just snap like that. And it works nice. Um, so, so. <coughs> It's also easy to undo when you do this. So, see how much easier that was? No, I don't need to take all of them. But, uh, so, they're now in the same position, and this could actually also be nice if you don't want to merge them but you just want those um, just want those separate for some reason um, of course if you do want to merge just merge normally but um, this is a way to uh, to get rid of that mistake of selecting background points uh, so yeah a good trick actually in order to make that work nicely <clears throat>